Computers do exactly what we tell them rather than what we mean, and this is definitely a problem. The computer is just going to do exactly what you tell it to do. It's just where computational thinking comes in. I'm Rachel Pottinger. I'm a faculty member in the Department of Computer Science. This year I am working on developing and ramping out the new course on computational thinking. Computational thinking is the process of defining a problem in its solutions in a term such that some sort of an information processing agent can solve it, whether that's a computer or another person. It's still thinking. It's just making sure that you're specifying things very precisely. For example, on a classic computational thinking problem is teaching someone how to make a peanut butter and jelly sandwich. And if you were going to do this problem, what you might discover is that a lot of people will start by saying, put the peanut butter on the bread. Only they're not specifying, should I put it on the side of the bread, should I put it on the top of the bread, and so on. Yes, a lot of people are users these days, but a lot of people really aren't thinking about the details about what's happening in the background and how the computer actually works. We're looking at what is artificial intelligence? What is an algorithm? How does the internet work? How does the information get sent from computer to computer? Should Google be allowed to sell you ads? What spam to click on and what spam not to click on? At the highest level, my goal is to warp their brains.